All right, guys, let me explain a little bit what today's video is about. Uh, I've got my Magnum Research MLR1722 out here on the bench, and I'm playing with the action screw torque. And uh, I stumbled across some videos on this a few weeks ago, and I've been experimenting around with this a little bit. So um, decided to come out here and do a video about it. I'm going to show you the results here. I'm using CCI 40 grain segmented hollow points um, for every one of these groups. This first group right here, the action screw was set at 15 inch pounds. Um, the second group was set at 20 inch pounds. The third one was set at 22 inch pounds. And as you can see, it really seemed to like it right there. Um, I moved over to the next group at 25 inch pounds. The group opened back up. I went, I bumped it up to about 28 inch pounds. I'm using a manual gauge, so I'm just going in between the 25 and the 30 and calling it 28. And the same here on this 22, I'm in, I'm in between the uh, 20 and 25. Uh, but there again, this was around 28 inch pounds. The group opened up. I bumped it up to 30 inch pounds and it was just one solid hole. So I'm gonna say either one of these two would probably be okay. I'm gonna bump it back down to 22 inch pounds and I'm gonna shoot, uh, I don't know how many bullets I've brought out here. I'm gonna shoot one to two more groups at 22 and the same at 30. And I'm gonna see which one it seems to like the most. And that's what I'm gonna set this gun at. And that's what we're gonna hunt with it at the rest of the season. So uh, we'll get back to the bench and uh, see what we can do with it. So I'm gonna start here. Uh, this will be 30 inch pounds, 30 inch pounds, 22 and 22. All right, guys, so there you have it. That's the end result of the uh, action screw torque test. Um, these were 30 inch pounds, these two, and the bottom two were at 22 inch pounds. So on the, on the first go around, I thought the 30 was gonna win this thing, um, but the groups opened up just a little bit down here when I put more rounds through it. So I'm gonna set this one, I'm gonna leave it set on 22 inch pounds and uh, we're just gonna run with it from there. All right guys, I wanna thank you for your time and watching my little boring video here. I uh, just wanted to cover one thing uh, for those people who aren't familiar with the Ruger 1022. Uh, this is the action screw that I've been torquing today. Um, I just use a basic Wheeler torque wrench. You can pick these up at uh, any sporting goods store. Uh, 22 and 30 shot the best. So we went back to that, shot two more groups out of 30 and two more out of 22, and it looks like I'm gonna leave this rifle 
uh, set on 22 inch pounds uh, for the remainder of this hunting season. And uh, again, I want to thank you for your time and thank you for watching my little video and we'll catch you next time. Be safe.